Hello and welcome to another video on my channel. My name is Mathmedy, I make Minecraft Bedrock Edition content and today I have a horizontal triple piston extender for you. It is one block high and stackable. So let me just quickly show it to you. So as you can see I have three of these on top of each other and let's just activate the first and the third and then the second and then deactivate the first and then deactivate the third and then deactivate the second. And then you should be able to see that it all works very good. It's 100% reliable from my testing so it should work all of the time and yeah without further ado let's hop straight into the tutorial to build this triple piston extender you will need five normal pistons 24 sticky pistons 15 redstone blocks 8 redstone torches 34 observers 10 solid blocks don't have to be wool and I don't think that all of them have to be solid but some have to be so let's just use 10 solid blocks and one lever oh that was 64 anyways let's just get him out of here and that's for one piston extender and then no matter how many of them you stack on top of each other you will need five obsidian now let's do the tutorial all right, start by placing your three pistons wherever you want the triple piston extender to be. Then place your block that you want to move. Then go next to it and place those three observers in. And then let's continue with the observers. Place three observers like this. Then place another one like this. Not like this, but like this. Then place another one like this. And one like this. No, not like this, but like this. Oh my goodness, oh yeah, I placed it right. Just wanted to make sure. Then place one, two, three, four observers like this. And then one in this direction. Then next on go here and place one, two observers like this. And then place another one like this. And three like this. Then continue by placing one like this and two like this. It will all make sense in a moment, I hope. Here is the observer picture so that you can build this for yourself. Then continue by placing one, two blocks from this one and then one here and one here. Simple, right? At least it's not too hard, in my opinion. Then, yeah, this can get moved, but that doesn't really matter. Then, continue back here with placing one, two, three, four, five observers like this. And one observer like this. Then place another two observers like this. And now you should be done with all of your observers. So let's continue with our sticky pistons. Because these are what I would do next. One here. And then a redstone block, and then one around the corner, and here, and then like this. You can see it and count it for yourself. I mean, it's directly, oops, 
next to each other with one block difference. It's not that hard, I would say, to build these. Then here with a block, this doesn't have to be solid. Here, solid block, piston, and redstone block. Then go around the corner, back here, you see where it is. Then place another sticky piston, redstone block, sticky piston, redstone block, sticky piston, redstone block, sticky piston, whatever block. Another sticky piston, whatever block, and a solid block with a torch on it. Then here have another sticky piston with another block that doesn't matter what block it is. And have another sticky piston here with another block. Again, it doesn't matter what block it is. It doesn't even have to be solid there. And then place another sticky piston here. Redstone block. Sticky piston. And redstone block. You know how it's done. It's just to transfer the signal like all of these observers. Then go here and place another sticky piston and another redstone block. Another sticky piston here and another block here. Doesn't matter what block it is. Then here, where I had that obsidian, go and place one normal piston. I hope that you can see where it is, then place obsidian on top of it, if this is your uh, your piston extender on the top, if, uh, you are, if you are planning on building multiple, then you can leave it for now and then build the other ones on top of it, and then as you saw here, you have to place two redstone torches on it like this. Then have another solid block here, and this is already the block you wanted to extend, just got moved a bit. Then, if you want to build multiple of these, you will have to remove those redstone torches here, and place this here, and like this, and then you can get those torches. Oh no you should place obsidian in first because otherwise you're going to have a bit of a problem like this and then place all of your torches in again did I place it? oh man come on let me just place this redstone torch there we go and then another one on here and that would be done here. Then we all, oh, no, you don't need that one. That was just me misplacing stuff. Then we are done with this and we just need the activation. If you haven't already, place a lever on here and then it will get a bit tricky sometimes. Stick piston, sticky piston, sticky piston, red some block, red some block, red some block. That's easy. That's the easy part. Okay, then next, if you have already built some, you have to remove those redstone torches again or not build them at all. And then place a normal piston here. Again, obsidian depends on what you're doing. And then, because we have these deactivated, we are going to place the one here first. And then, place these. Oh no, that one was... Oh man, did I really just... I misplace everything. Like, seriously. Everything. Yeah, I'll fix it or not. Let me just quickly fix that. That was not planned. <laughs> Alright. 
once you got that torch in here again box and the last one will be here is it the last one i think so yeah sure and then you need another torch there and another torch here and that should do the trick already let's try this oh i think i forgot one torch yeah here you have to have torches like um, this because otherwise it won't work there you go now it's extended and once i flick this again it should all get retracted there you go you see it works amazing that's it for today thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video if so please make sure to leave a like and subscribe thank you very much and good bye see you in the next video